We have an update on the deadly car accident we told you about this morning. Lansing police tell us the driver was a 37 year old man and they believe he was speeding. His car went airborne and broke into several pieces when it hit a tree on Oakland Avenue. Kel and Buddy talk with people in that neighborhood and brings us this report. It was a boom and uh, figured somebody probably hit something and it was pretty awful. Tammy Morris and Karen Jackson, two of many people in the old Oakland neighborhood who watched in shock as first responders dealt with Thursday morning's crash. They were here for a good three hours, you know, working the, working the scene. We all kind of just tried to do what, what we could, you know. Um, I know I prayed. Yep, I prayed too. Yeah, and we prayed for the family, we're thinking of the family today. Yeah. The neighbors tell us that the driver had to be going at least 100 miles per hour. The accident caused extensive damage to their truck and their property. They say they'll be cleaning for days. It ended up in our fence, hit our truck, hit a light post, hit a tree. So it was awful. Yeah, we have like half the tele or the light pole in our in our yard in our backyard. Morris and Jackson spending all morning and afternoon picking up shards of glass, metal, and wood, cleaning up reminders of a terrible scene. It's just tragic what happened here. And again, we feel so ho horrible yeah. for the family. Because this, this shakes you up. You know, you realize how quickly, you know, one second you're here and one second you're gone. In Lansing, Kellen Buddy, Fox 47 News. Lansing police say speed was at least part of the reason for the accident. The driver's name will be released once the family has been notified.